Hi, in this video I will show you how to use FoxPro DBF to CSV file app and this is my um, website I will link on the site in the description. To find app I will uh, type in search FoxPro and here it is FoxPro to CSV. I will click on a page, double click on the load button to start downloading process. until archive will be downloaded and just click on downloaded archive yep. then click on MSI when archive will be open click on MSI and double click on MSI inside archive to start installation and then click on more info here I'm getting the screen from Windows because I'm not registered publisher you can see publisher unknown I'll just click run anyway to start Installation, click on next, next install, click on yes, and click on finish. Uh, you can see there is a new shortcut on my desktop. Now I can close this and minimize this. I have two, uh, two apps installed right now. It's one is converted to SQL, another is converted to CSV. So this is what we installed. I will double click on FoxPro to CSV to launch app. And now it's like conversion CSV file is like three steps pro uh, conversion Fox Pro to CSV file is like three steps process. On first step, I have to select the Fox Pro DBF file. I click on this button to select my DBF, and I click on next step. There are no options here yet. If you think of any options, please let me know. I will add it here. I'll uh, click on next and click on run to start uh, conversion to CSV. Here I can specify the name of the file and location. This name and location is going to just click save and file will be saved. Now I can go and open this file. So I can open it into uh, edit notepad, right, to see that CSV is just the data all data. First row will be like um, column names and then all data from DBF into columns. I can also, I, ha I have created uh, different apps, it's called CSV Viewer. It's just showing uh, content of CSV files inside and I can go and view them or like export into different format if I want. So this is our CSV file and also, I can open it into Excel, but I don't have Excel. I have Excel Mobile, which is free, but it's kind of like limited functionality. I cannot resize columns or anything. Uh, but you can see it's nicely shown here in Excel with all with all data in here. I have um, first name, last name, organization, URL, email, or address. Yeah, but I cannot resize it. Yeah because like I don't have, uh, I have this only book, uh, CSV Excel view, right? So if you have a normal Excel and you will open it, you will be able to resize it and change it whenever you want. So yeah, basically that's it. If you have any questions, uh, please, leave, uh, please leave them in the comments. Thank you.